Now that we know what variables are, we can do some mathematical operations with them. So I'm going to show you a couple of examples. You'll see how to use simple and arithmetic uh, operations such as um, adding, subtracting, multiplying and div division. Um, first example, let's tr transform from hours to seconds. So I'm going to define a variable that will keep the number of hours. Let's, call, let's say it's 10 hours and I want to calculate the number of seconds. So that's very simple. You just have to multiply hours times um, 3600 and that will give you the number of seconds. So that's how we, we are multiplying using this sign. And I'll have that shown in our console. See how um, as I start typing a variable my code editor shows me already options that I can pick from. By pressing enter I can just have that um, completed will reload the page with, uh, with F5 and there we go. Um, we can also um, we'll, we'll do a, a, a transformation from Celsius degrees to Fahrenheit so what about 36 Celsius degrees and we want to have that transformed and that is done by uh, multiplying the number of Celsius degrees times 9 divided by 5 and then plus 30, uh, 32. So that's the formula. And this is so this is for division, this is for multiplication, um, adding and subtracting is just a minus sign. And now the, um, regarding the, the precedence of the um, operations, it's the same as in um, normal mathematics, which is that uh, multiplications and divisions take precedence over um, sums and subtractions. Also if you use um, if you use brackets um, that the, the things that are inside the brackets get evaluated first. So for example um, I'm just gonna do the operation inside the, the console. If I have 2 plus 3 times 2 right that that should be this will be um, evaluated first that's 6 6 plus 2 that's 8 but if I have if I do this instead right what's inside the brackets um, gets um, evaluated first so that's 5 and then 5 plus 2 that uh, times 2 that's 10 um, so let's let's see those two results so as you can see um, it this is the same way that um, that uh, algebra works normal high school algebra um, it's um, applied in the same manner when you're doing a when you're using a programming language. So just to summarize, um, variables can be numbers, and they can be um, we we can use all um, operation arithmetic operations. Um, there's also you you can also use decimals like this, and that works just fine. And and the the presence of the operations is the same as in. Uh, um, high school algebra, which